how is everybody's Monday going? This is how ours is going. Okay, so this is us unloading the slabs. As you can see, they all fell over in the lorry. <laughs> Uh, we ended up with three truckloads, three arctics full of slabs, enough for all the greenhouses loads. There we go. Two arctics done. So, the grab's ready. The twister's ready. We'll make a start while everybody else, um, I don't know what they're doing, cubes. Last one on this side, these ones aren't twisted. But then we're back over here. Going back towards the door. Hopefully we'll get that bit done today. And we're on track. There we go. So it's not not a bad one. Sometimes uh, depending on how we drop it, the coils come loose and then it, it's very hard to get it in. So this, uh, it's not too bad. It's having to go quite high, but at least there's nothing left behind on the floor. <laughs> Ta-da! You can actually see the stems piled up from the distance. Huge. That looks mega. Let's get a close up. Oh, this is the last one. That's what he's telling me. Last one going in. Here we go! 2021 is complete! Woohoo! <laughs> How do you feel, Tony? Complete? Sad. I know! <laughs> there you go, it is kind of a harrowing moment, sad, sad. isn't it? <laughs> I, was just, um, I was just saying to the camera. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Look at all these over here piled up. I know. And that's organised. I know. It's a big pile. <laughs> I know, I dread to think what it looked like oh, if we didn't have Rob and if we just kind of chucked him on. But spread out all over, all over Cheshire. All over Cheshire. Greater Manchester <laughs> area. Yeah. <laughs> I think we're max at that. <laughs> <laughs> I know. <laughs> now that all the stems have finished, what everybody has been cracking on with is taking the pegs off here, um, ready for a clean, and we tie these in a little loop so they don't touch the floor. Um, and these will get disinfected um, to the irrigation system. Um, once they've done that, they've been cutting off the cubes, which is this here. Uh, and these all just go into a skip. There is nothing we can do with these. Um, so they've actually really cracked on. They've already done side B and they're making their way back on side A. Uh, and they've already done sort of this half of side A. So they've maybe got a quarter to go, which is quite good. Um, and then we go around and pick any large bits off the floor and put that in the skip so we can start washing down the interior glass um, so you can't have any debris over the pipes because the machines won't run. Also have to check that these stands are secure because we don't want anybody falling off them. So that's what's next. Here we are on the slabs. So it took half a day for about seven of us to go around pre-cutting all the bags. It then took a day and a half for about nine of us to do this operation here. So uh, we'd have teams going down collecting them and then we'd have another team on the concrete and we were just literally emptying them all into the skips, which me and Jack were on the JCBs um, alternating, getting fresh, fresh baskets ready. So this was a day and a half for about nine of us. This is footage actually from one of our older greenhouses, but it's the same principle. So the next job is to hoover this place. So we'd have um, two guys on the windblowers and another guy trying to keep up on the hoover, which as you can see, uh, there's actually quite a lot of rubbish on the floor. So we would do this once, get the majority up, um, then the, the window cleaners would come in and clean and we'd clean all the irrigation and everything and then we'd hoover again after. But as you can see, this was a huge job and actually just took forever. <laughs> the next job was power washing the trough. So 
Uh, we had three teams, so three teams of two guys. They went down on trolleys with power washers connected to it and uh, we'd have like an assistant which would make sure that the pipe didn't get snagged on anything and this takes them three days to, to do 85 paths. This is one of the trolleys that gets used for cleaning. So it's already done a, a fair stint. As you can see, all the salts and feed and whatnot that's come off. Next up, T, the window cleaner, arrived. Usually they turn up before because we like to wash from top to bottom, but they got delayed. So this is them and their machines. They have two big glass washing machines. Uh, we have one. I could do a run through on that. They're the craziest looking things ever. They're just mad. Um, so anyway, this took them about a day and a half, three of them in and out, dead quick. He knows what he's doing. <laughs> We then had to hoover again, but this time we had to get all the tomatoes from under the Mypex. So Cece's here on the left, and we had to do it on all four corners, anywhere there was a fold, get the tomatoes out, and then the boys could hoover once again. Finally on the clean, the guys could then power wash the concrete, so they just folded back the Mypex so as to not get it dirty. Quick power wash, and then we went on to disinfect the place. Here's our toe disinfecting. We used Unifact G, uh, it could have been Vercon, who knows, something along them lines. Took him a day and a bit, but he was on his own because we were busy on the other side, so sorry Tony, had to put up with that one. Finally, it was time to get the new slabs out, which took a day, which was the quickest we'd ever done it and then to pop the pegs on the irrigation into the bags so Christopher could wet them up over Christmas. And we actually got finished in time this year, so it's all swinging, as Christopher would say. I'm now going to leave you with a little question time with Transformation Tony in his workshop. I hope you enjoy. See you when the plants arrive. I had some feedback on my last video. Yes, um, and... There was a few viewers who had no idea who we were or what we were doing. So, I'm going to ask you some questions. What? Who are you? <laughs> Tony. What do you grow? Tomatoes. How long have you grown tomatoes for? <gasps> 40 years. <gasps> oh my goodness. You're over 40. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> um, uh, so... Who's who's been helping you grow tomatoes? Uh, brother, Christopher. A brother? Um, Should I be looking at the camera? No, it's all right. You have got your hands tied. Very busy. <laughs> I've interrupted you clearly. Yeah. <laughs> so, how many acres have you got? Um, nine at the minute. <clears throat> Brilliant. At the minute, what does that mean? We, we might be putting uh, another block up. <gasps> three and a half acres. Oh, that's a bit cheeky. Oh, Where's that cheeky. going? Oh, hey! Straight on the back of this bad boy. Yeah, that's exciting. When, when are we thinking this is going to happen then? Well, maybe next year. We'll see. We'll see. Exciting stuff. Yes. Um, we've actually caught Tony in his workshop. <laughs>